Hello, Libras. Welcome to Visions of Light and Love. This is your reading for the first week in February. This reading is for all of my Libras out there. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the first week in February. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If this reading does not resonate with your sun sign, check out the Moon, Venus, and Rising sign video to get a fuller story. Cross watchers are welcome as well. If you find that the reading resonates with your situation, comment below, let me know. Also, um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't to show some support. Um, hit the thumbs up image as well as the notification bell so that you are notified when new videos are posted. Okay, so we're starting off Libras with do something for someone. You may need to give someone some attention. Someone may need your attention at this time. Okay. Okay, that's too many. Spirit, what is the energy for my Libras? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the first week in February. Here we go. Okay. We have Appreciate the Moment. Some of you may be in your head about something. Honesty is essential. Either you or someone needs to be honest about a situation. Look to your inner strength. And ask for help. So I feel like some of you need to... Um, Just randomly do something for someone. Randomly do something for someone. And in that, where it says appreciate the moment, you will appreciate that moment. And um, I feel like some of you may need to be your genuine self. Ask for help if you need it. If you need to talk to someone talk about your situation because you may be going through something and some of you may have shut down to some people certain people you um and you may need someone's help to get you through something you may need to uh seek help from the universe go within to find the answers that you are looking for. But let's find out. And this could be you or your partner or someone in your environment. Because in tarot, the energies, it could be someone in your heart space that is going through this. And it's coming, it may come out and you're okay. So we have, I didn't even say anything, but it eight of eight of wands. We have the eight of wands. Ooh. Okay, the three of cups in the reverse. Three of cups in the reverse. The six of wands. Okay. What is the energy for my Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Something needs to be balanced out at this time. What is the energy for my Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? We have the Seven of Wands. The King of Pentacles. The Six of Pentacles. King of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles. Just put that down a little bit more so your bottom row can be seen. Okay, we have the Ace of Cups. The Hierophant. Okay. 
was the Hierophant. Some of you may be dealing with the Taurus or someone has Taurus in their chart. We have the Five of Cups at the bottom of the deck. We have the Ten of Swords. I feel like at this time, you or someone is disappointed because disappointed, feeling stabbed in the back. Maybe because they want to take action, quick action. They may want to communicate or take some quick action and move forward in something like some type of celebration or something, but they can't with the three of cups in the reverse. This person um, wants to party and receive some type of attention, but they're not at this time. Things are not moving as fast as they want them to. And it's causing either you or them. Again, apply, apply the energy as it fits to your story. Someone is disappointed about not being able to come in quickly to celebrate and get your attention or you their attention. Someone feels as if their back is up against the wall. They feel like they have um, lots of obstacles in their way. And they can't move forward to stability. They feel like they are blocked from stability. Yeah. Could be blocked from money as well. So someone is sitting there trying to figure out what they are going to do. This person could have been given to multiple people, multiple things. And now they want a new beginning in love. Or you want a new beginning in love. With this hierophant. Someone may be um, seeking advice from other people. Someone may be get, trying to get some enlightenment from the universe. Listening to their higher conscience. Because this person is hurting and disappointed. We started out with disappointment and and ended with disappointment. So something is going on. So let's find out. Why is the Eight of Wands here? For my Libras, Sun Moon, Sun Moon Rising, and Venus. Okay? Yeah, see, this person wants to move quickly, but they can't with that Knight of Pentacles. This person is, um, something that is going on is, um, taking a really long time. And, um... I feel like with the five of wands in reverse, this person is tired of fighting about it. Someone is tired here because whatever is going on is taking a long time. It's taking too long for them. Okay. You see, it's taking too long and this is why this person feels disappointed and stabbed in the back. Something didn't work out the way they wanted it to. And um, with this double energy, Capricorn's energy, someone is feeling... Someone may have been manipulated into doing something. Someone may have been overindulging in things. Having addic addictions, not listening to their intuition with their high priestess cancer pisces energy and um now they're sitting back disappointed their initials may start with a j or a b someone has the initials of j or b and with this hermit card someone didn't go within to um to gain some type of wisdom And now this person, now this person is feeling disappointment. They may, you, you may be blocked from this person or restricted with their two of swords. Someone may have moved away or moved on with the chariot card. We have cancer energy here. Someone may have moved away. Some, some type of blockage took place. 
moved, moved on and moved away or something. Someone that you love with this King of Cups or they love you. Um, let me just say the, the energies that are here, that is here. Again, we have Virgo, Cancer, Pisces, and uh, Capricorn's energy and Taurus. Okay? So, why is this King of Cups here? This is someone that you love, but there is some type of restriction, some blockage, or someone moved away or moved on from the situation. And you love this person, or they love you. Okay. Someone feels like they don't have any other option with the seven of cups and a reverse. Feeling like they have to start from scratch. This person, you may hear from this person or they may hear from you. There may be a text message, a phone call, an email, or a letter. Someone is putting forth some type of effort so that they can be successful in this unit. Union. This person wants a new passionate beginning. Could be thinking about having sex. They want to work on this this relationship with you, or you with them. Be and that's why they they want to work on it because they someone wants a new beginning in love. Yeah. See, but they can't get to you, or there is some type of. They, they either walked away or you walked away or there was some type of financial hardship. Something happened to where as though this person is unable to come. Someone needs to overcome some obstacles or something triumphant in their life. They need to overcome something, cut some things out with their ace of swords, speak their truth. Gemini energy lovers is here in order to um, make a decision. So why is the lover's card here? What is this decision about? Okay. Someone has a decision to make. Someone has a, de a, a decision to make because Something came full circle with the world card. Something came full circle. And I feel like with the King of Cups and the reverse, someone is, something came full circle and someone is losing emotion.